Hello Stampers, welcome. My name is Terry Hartley. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator in the United States. And I'm at Rustic Barn Cards. I'm glad you're here. Today I have a quick and easy card for you using some designer series paper out of the new mini July through December 2021 catalog. And yay, I can open it and show you the inside of the catalog. And we like to call it the holiday catalog because there's lots of holiday stamps and items in there for the holidays, along with other things that you can use besides just the holiday. And if you do not have a mini catalog, reach out to me and I'd be glad to send you one. Also during August and September, we're having celebration. And celebration is when you place a qualifying order you can choose a free gift from the celebration catalog. And you can read more about that at my website when I turn the camera down, you'll see my web page. So you can go over there and check it out and also click the link down below in the description. So let me turn the camera down and let's start stamping. Okay, and as I said, this is my web page www.rusticbarncards.com my august host code w g z e e 9 t m and use that host code when you place an order with me when it's less than when it's 149 dollars or less otherwise stampin up gives you rewards and this way i can give you a thank you gift for ordering for, uh, from me so celebration and the mini catalog has gone live. I'm so excited. And today I am going to be making a card using designer series paper on page 31. 3031 is a sweet stocking sweet. It has this adorable stamp set and dies that go with it. And you can buy the entire suite and that's everything on page 31 or you can pick and choose what you want so today I am going to use cardstock and designer series paper and a label punch and some embellishments and that's it so we're gonna make a quick and easy Christmas card And as I said, celebration, so when you place a $50 order from the mini catalog or the annual catalog, you can combine those, you can receive a free item from the celebration. There's also items in the celebration that you can choose free if you place a $100 order. If you place a $100 order, you can choose one of the $100 choices or you can choose two of the $50 choices. So, for an example, here's this dazzling specialty paper. So if you place a $50 order, you can choose this for free. And then, Summer Shade Dyes is free with $100. So if you choose, or if you order $100 from the mini catalog, you can choose this or the delicate dahlia stamp set or you could choose two of the free items for fifty dollars so i hope that makes sense okay let me move that aside and again celebration is from um it's right now through the end of September and if you are not subscribed to the paper pumpkin kit this is a fun kit that comes to your house every month and right now you can sign up for uh, the August kit which is called hope box and if it's your first time subscribing you will be able to um, you'll have a actual block in the kit and then every month you have everything you need to make cards along with the ink spot and stamps die cuts and this month you have enough supplies to create nine cards and coordinating envelopes and you have a sp uh, stampin spot and the box is designed to be a keepsake box 
with mementos or cherished memories, or you can add things in here and, and give it to someone after you make the cards. And this was uh, designed by Shelley Gardner, Stampin' Up's co-founder. And then real quick before we make the card, I wanted to tell you about my online class this month. And if you place an online order for $50 without tax and shipping, and you'll be using this host code, which is different than my regular ordering host code. If you use this host code, you'll be part of the class and sign up between now and the 15th. And I will send you a free packet, including a uh, cardstock, ribbon and die cutouts, and the black dots to make one of each of these three cute cards. And again, uh, you can go over to my webpage and get more information. You also will get a video how to make each of the cards. And then I want to tell you about the uh, joining special right now. So if you choose, you can choose $125 worth of product, pay only $99 plus free shipping. And right now we have a joining special where you can also pick out a bundle with, uh, with your kit. And you always get a free paper pumpkin in your kit too. So. This is a great time to join my team. You can, I mean, one of the reasons I joined was to get the 20% discount. As I know, uh, the law, most people on my team, that's why they joined, is to get that 20% discount. So you don't need to sell. There, um, you do have to have a minimum order over a certain time. But if you don't, you just go back to being a regular customer. So there's no penalty or anything like that. And we get together once a month with my, I get together once a month with my team on Zoom and we celebrate each other's accomplishments, birthdays, and, and have a lot of fun. So if you would like to join my team, again, uh, reach out to me. You can call me, go to my website, and those links will be in the description down below. Okay. That's enough business. Let's go ahead and let's start stamping. So you're going to need one ink, real red today. And we're going to need a card base. And this is eight and a half by five and a half. And we're going to fold that in half. I've chosen this designer series paper. And of course, our designer series paper is always on two sides. And then we have a layer. We have two. We'll have two layers, one for the front, one for the inside. And this is cut at uh, five and a fourth by four. And we will be uh, using this label me lovely punch, which is in the annual catalog. And those of you that watch me regularly know that I love punches because they're quick and easy. And. You may have noticed that the background today was not my regular um, stamping studio, and that's because I'm not home right now. I'm in Florida, and I did bring some items so I could continue to bring uh, videos to you. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. I guess I had two sheets of... So we're going to go ahead and fold this in half. And this is Cherry Cobbler. So if you have Cherry, cherry Cobbler ink, uh, you would want to use that. But um, as I said, I am in Florida and I do not have all of my stamping items here. So I'm going to use um, Real Red for the sentiment, but I could use Basic Black too. So I'm going to go ahead and add some Stamp and Seal Plus. And add that layer inside our card. I'll put it this way so I can see it easier. Get it lined up. 
can stamp and seal does not isn't very forgiving so you have to make sure that you're ready to to place it down right okay I'm going to go ahead and add the basic white layer and again this is five and a fourth by four and I'm just going to pop that right on the front but before I do that I'm going to go ahead and bring my bone folder in and give this fold kind of a little crisper edge than what it was going to be okay so I'm going to kind of line this up and then I'm going to hold it with my fingernail and make sure that I have about the same on the other side before I place it down and then once I'm happy with that then I'll, I'll press that down and then I'm going to bring in my paper trimmer so move this stuff out of the way and I'm going to bring in designer series paper and I'm going to cut this at five inches and then turn it and trim it at three and three-fourths. I'll move that back out of the way. And now we're ready to add this to our card. And I think I will use the liquid glue. And we will make sure that it is going the correct direction, right? We don't want our little dogs and our kittens upside down. This is such cute. I mean, just love this designer series paper. Then you're going to need a scrap of basic white. And I like to stamp before I use my punch. So I'm going to go ahead and open my ink pad, bring in my stamp. And I'm going to bring in, uh, from the Peaceful Deer, I'm going to use uh, the sentiment, Sending Love and Peace This Season. So that's, uh, you can use a sentiment from the stamp set that goes with the designer series paper, or you can just use any, any of the sentiments that you have on your, in your, on your stamps. And I don't think I, that was real straight, so we're going to try that again. Let's see if we can line that up better. Much better. Okay, let me close up the ink. We'll bring in our punch. And punch this out. Then we're going to turn this over and add some dimensionals. So I've added five dimensionals. I'm going to turn that over, bring in our card, and I'm going to place this right in the middle of our card. Bring in wonderful gems. And I am going to use the putty end. I think I'm going to use the larger because I'm just going to add one gem right up here. And here is our quick and easy card. I have another card to show you. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please consider by subscribing by clicking that subscribe button. I really appreciate that and that helps me to get noticed and push out the videos to you. So here is the uh, first card that I made and it's pretty much the same except I used Merry Christmas and um, one embellishment also on that on a and then this one I used the wonderful gems I'm not I can't remember one of the dots that I used I can't remember what it's called that I used on the first on this first card so again a quick and easy card especially if you're going to make multiple cards to send around the holidays uh, you might consider something just really quick and easy simple but yet very nice so please leave a comment. I love reading all your comments. So let me know what you think. 
I appreciate you watching. Thank you. Again, Terry Hartley at Rustic Barn Cards. Have a great day.